What's up everybody? Welcome back to Collecting and Hobbies. Today we're going to do a um, brief update. Uh, I've been meaning to do this for quite some time. The image that you're looking at is the Han Solo in Mud Trooper disguise. These are out of box photos. Sorry for the glare. <clears throat> this phone, I don't know how well this is going to pick up from phone to phone, but um, I've been meaning to do this a couple weeks ago when my friend told me that these were already released out in China. And I did do a uh, podcast on the First Jedi podcast. I did talk about them on there, <clears throat> saying that they were about to hit the Philippines and the United States. It's just a matter of days or maybe even weeks. And, uh, yeah, about two weeks later, after I found out that they hit China, they already spotted at Target. Now, this particular figure, though, this was ordered on Amazon.com in the United States um, on February 5th. And that's how I knew that they were coming. Well, one of the reasons why. But, uh, yeah, this particular guy's order did not get canceled. So he received this like around uh, February, um, around Valentine's Day, a couple, or maybe like February 10th or something like that. A couple days after February 5th, you know, the two day shipping. There he is with his little cape on. And we got plenty of news since I'm doing this a little late. I got some news from stuff that's going to be revealed at Toy Fair as well. So by the time I put this up, this will be uh, already out there in the public. So I can't get in trouble for revealing all this stuff. <laughs> so I guess it's a good thing that I waited. And by now, these have actually already hit a couple of websites, too, like news sites and stuff. So if you don't want to track this down at Target, you could always... So Star Wars SWS2 BL Zeus Brown. That's the actual Amazon link. Or the There's a couple of guys selling it for $45. <laughs> But I wouldn't pay for that, you know, not that much. Especially because this has already happened. These, this is an image from Target. It's kind of a bad image. Well, it's kind of zoomed in too much. But there's Padme, there's Han Solo, the Battle Droid, Mace Windu. Uh, the other figures in the assortment are Vice Admiral Holdo and... Um, uh, Dryden Voss, the bad guy from Solo. So these have already been found at Target. I suggest... Uh, th these were found, I think, in Ohio, this particular image. They've also been spotted in uh, Washington State and also Southern California, of course. Because Southern California gets everything first. You can also pre-order those at Dorkside Toys, Entertainment Earth... Um, yeah, all those big bad toy store. I would go with Dorkside because they're the cheapest. But um, this is the new Star Wars figures that I don't know if a lot of people have heard about these, but they're re-releasing the retro, the old Kenner. They're re-releasing old Kenner figures, basically. But if you look at the packaging, it looks like it's like uh, been up and stuff like that and retro collections. So I guess... They're doing that on purpose to make it look like it's an old Star Wars figure. <laughs> now, these are also available right now. Well, uh, technically they release in May, I believe. On um, They're going to be Target exclusives, I think. Not sure if they're exclusive to Target, but uh, they will be at Target. Um, the Han Solo Stormtrooper disguise will be exclusive to Target for uh, the Vintage collection and so will uh, the uh, Luke Skywalker Stormtrooper 
right here that um uh, known about for quite a while they uh, revealed this I think at San Diego Comic Con or New York Toy Fair or something like that last year but uh, these are already up for pre-order but these are already sold out so are all those vintage figures but it says on here that they uh, released May 12th so they're already sold out Let's see if I can find, see pre-order sold out released May 12th I was actually about to report on that anyway because I heard that he was people already had early samples of him overseas he's already been released overseas so um, that's why you got the uh, what do you call it the uh, the pre-orders are already up that's why you know there's the Chewbacca so I guess they're gonna release these in two waves one in the summer and one in the fall the first six figures are Darth Vader Chewbacca Han Solo Princess Leia Luke Skywalker and a stormtrooper and these are all uh, at Target there's Darth Vader Yeah, as like I said, this they've already started reporting this on uh, some of the news channels here. 6PS, no, TBS Wave 20 hitting Target. Target exclusive Luke Skywalker Stormtrooper pre-order. Yeah, so here's the uh, the vintage collection Han Solo Stormtrooper disguise. Can't really see it real well. He does have the face print technology. The helmet looks good. Looks like the Rogue One helmet hollowed out hopefully and uh, yeah hopefully this is I think that's the Memban Stormtroopers mold reused but in white so this will be hopefully more or less an all new Han Solo Stormtrooper disguise not 100% sure about that I didn't collect these when they first came out so that's uh what people are hoping at least so another thing if you haven't already uh, go ahead and order General Grievous he's up uh, the 6 inch black series General Grievous is up for pre-order the jump or rocket trooper whichever you want to call it uh, he's a GameStop exclusive um, General Grievous is online exclusive meaning you can buy him like a big bad toy store or entertainment earth or Dork side toys. Um, he's twenty nine ninety nine. I'll get an image of him for you real quick, and just to show you, you can order him right now. Dork side toys. There's a uh, some battle droid eight pack. There's a uh, the whole series, the new ones. It's a full case right there. There's the uh, six pack. Just the six new figures and no duplicates. And you can order Battle Droids separately or Padme. There's the Han Solo. He wasn't up last time I looked. Finally got him up. There's Darden Voss. There's Holdo. And a big case of Holdos. I don't know why anybody would want that. but <laughs> And there you go. There's the General Grievous. He's $29.99. Now, he should be shipping any day now, like in the last half of February, because he's due out in March. Um, they're still doing pre-orders for him and him. <laughs> I've only seen Dengar in stock twice on Hasbro. Oh, another thing, the uh, Hasbro Toy Shop is now called HasbroPulse.com. If you sign up by the 23rd, uh, if you buy something from them by the 23rd you will instantly get a premium um, membership where you will get free shipping on everything during the year of 2019 but you have to do it by February 23rd and uh, supposedly there's going to be some kind of new black series subscription service I'm sure we'll hear a lot more about this in the next coming hours on the uh, Toy Fair, but yeah, so 
Um, let's see if I can find you that jump trooper real quick. I know he's on GameStop.com. That's the only place. Well, in America, he'd be GameStop exclusive. But, um, uh, not sure what he'd be outside of America. But he's twenty two ninety nine. He's just a regular figure, technically. Um, let's see what they got up here. They got Hothlea Val. There he is, right there. Twenty two ninety nine. He releases releases March fifteenth. Plus, the, some of the stores might actually get him before that, though. Uh, you can get a. There's a what's his name Grievous down there too, but he's five dollars more than Dorkside. Yeah, that's all they got on there uh, as far as images. But he's, um, I think he's from Rebels or Clone Wars or something like that. Rebels, I don't remember. But, all right, so that's about it. We're getting kind of long here. So check back. Frequently, I'm going to be doing some more news as soon as Toy Fair is over. Let you guys know everything that's coming out. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Check out the First Jedi podcast at www.buzzsprout.com/slash one two one two zero four. I'll put a link in the description below.